Chris Scanlon coming back at you with Sarah Smart. On this episode, I'm going to speak to a question I get quite often when I'm traveling around visiting researchers, especially those who aren't that familiar with the industry. And that is, do serum suppliers have their own cows? Do they have these herds around the world that they can turn to at any moment to get more supply? The simple answer is no. But I'll give you a little bit more details. Serum products are a byproduct of the meatpacking industry. So the more cows that are brought to process, the more supply. The less, the less supply. And not only does that su uh, impact supply, it also impacts price. So a great way to gauge you know, how this impacts the science industry is go to your favorite restaurant, order a New York strip steak. Go to your favorite grocery store or supermarket, get a chunk of ground beef. If the price has gone up, there's a good chance if it hasn't already, that serum prices will go up as well. So hopefully that gives you a little bit of insight into the world of Sarah and gives you a kind of an understanding of how we bring it to you. So as always, continue to subscribe. You know, I'm gonna be bringing you more videos, so keep a lookout. And I love the questions and comments, keep bringing them in. And as always, take care and see you later. Bye bye now.